Hi, welcome back to Impossible. Next up, I have Taurus. Hi, Taurus. Please bear with me. I'm dealing with a sick child. Um, I'm not doing any more personal readings. If you guys are interested in purchasing these spiritual bracelets, her name is Miss T. Cool. I'm going to be leaving her IG down below in my description box. And if you're interested in purchasing the Tazama deck, I'm also going to be leaving the link down below. Just use my code POSSIBLE for 10% discount. I was able to buy new cards. I actually did receive two more new decks today. I'm going to be using them on you. Um, yeah. Okay, let's begin. I haven't used this deck in a while. This is my Grand uh, Tarot Grand Lux deck. So I'm just going to do an energy check-in for you guys. The time now is 2.38. So I have, after you guys, three more videos to do. So let's get started. All right, Spirit, give me two cards to start off. Taurus energy, please. Wow, two it is. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. Knight of Wands, um, King of Wands, and the Two of Cups. King of Wands and the Two of Cups. Okay, so you guys are all about action right now. I'm just going to tell you the energies that I'm picking up. So you guys are all about actions, really playing the field right now, but really going after what you want at this time. The King of Wands is very confident. Take care of oneself. You guys are taking care of yourselves. Nothing good. Okay, but really passionate driven really action driven at this time two of club two of cups uh doesn't necessarily have to be love but i'm going to tell you about that aspect as well but somebody wants to come in somebody feels like they have a soul connection with you but with the two of cups there's a lot of self-reflection here about what you really want your desires okay what you're passionate about okay making amends with oneself all right that's in terms of yourself okay so a lot of introspection but action driven so you, some of you guys may have fire in your chart uh rising moon or venus and aries or sagittarius okay but definitely somebody wants to come in and take action they feel this soul connection with you um uh you may not know this person that's coming in for some of you guys this may be somebody new but i have to pull more cards to really pick up the energy some of you guys may know the person some of you guys may not know the person but king of wands is all about action so definitely somebody has their eye on you and wants to take action towards you they just feel like this magnetic pull when it comes to you this is possibly was a push and pull kind of dynamic going on with you and this person if you know them and it really didn't take off to anything uh serious okay uh stable all right but um with the king of wands this person could have been playing just playing the field some of you guys may have may just be playing the field right now doesn't want anything serious uh <laughs> okay because king of wands is like player type energy uh king of wands also um like to play mind games and have to like like uh khalil come here for one second baby like to have their cake and eat it too okay come here for one um pass me those two decks over there okay. um yeah it's a pink and green bag pink and green bag yes sorry about that yeah, so, um, yeah, so this is the energy, um, yes. overall energy, this, yeah, both of them. Is it green? Yeah. Thank you. Thanks. Thanks, baby. Okay. So these are my two new decks that came today. I'm going to be using them on you all. This is, uh, Maruk X, but it's all about, it's different, it's different sayings, and this one is, um, Ascending life oracle, okay? So yeah, so the other I'm gonna be doing um bonus readings for certain signs, but yeah <sighs> Taurus Yeah, so this is the overall energy. Okay, definitely a two of cups is coming in but um It's all about you what you want What you're passionate about? Okay, again, you could be playing the field all right, but this is something that never took off. If you know the person, this is something that never took off. They may be a, a fire sign, Aries or Sagittarius, as well. Okay, let's continue. Magician, somebody's trying to manifest you back at this time. This person may be a powerful uh, manifester, but you guys are manifesting what you want at this time. The magician is representation of Gemini. You guys are very wise, okay? Some of you guys may be chemists out there. Um, studying biology, but going back to college, old souls, okay? Some of you guys may be 
um, religious with the cross, okay, but no religious factors and spiritual factors. Um, really uh, traveling the world. Some of you guys may live in another country, but um, really exploring your options right now. But with the magician, um, manifesting what you want. Now with the magician, also this person who's coming in may be older, may have gray hair, a beard. Uh, maybe a father, a mother, a grandmother, a grandfather, but somebody older and wise. But this person knows how to manifest. They are very in tune with their spirituality. Okay? Like the high priestess, basically. Alright? But the magician is, um, yeah. Some of you guys may be learning tarot at this time. Love spells or spells and, yeah. You know, that's your prerogative but yeah the magician so you guys like to play mind games <laughs> this person was playing mind games all right but take it how it resonates yeah temperance yeah you see finding balance within oneself okay being patient at the same time all right and here go the two of cups again a lot of introspection self-reflection but it's all about your your own spiritual growth ascending to who you really are okay earth angels okay yeah star seeds spiritual workers humanitarian yeah four cups some of you guys are just fixated on one cup you have a lot of options but there's one cup that you're fixated on okay whether it's a job a house something that you want that's dear to your heart that you're manifesting at this time but your focus okay excuse me <sighs> sorry yeah but with the four cups uh some of you guys may be bored at a job um, feel like you're not happy with your circumstances where you at so you're manifesting a new life for yourself you understand that you can create anything you your mind is very powerful you could create anything right this is what you're doing right now so instead of instead of manifesting all at one time and your mind is out of whack right you're staying aligned with what you want to manifest at this time so one at a time you're doing one at a time. But somebody is uh, fixated on you as well, trying to manifest this back to these this two of cups. If you know the person. Okay, if you know the person. But for some of you guys, there's a new energy coming in. For some of you guys, you already know the person. But let's continue. But yeah, very bored, discontent. If you're in a long-term relationship, same thing. Uh, you don't feel anything moving forward with that. bored at a job okay just bored in a situation just but i don't see you taking any cups of love at this time i just see that you want your passion you're going after what you want and it has nothing to do with love at this time okay for some of you guys yes but i don't see it yet so let's continue okay knight of wands okay so definitely <laughs> oh uh, for some of you guys, you guys are just playing the field. What can I say? You know, just uh, in and out, in and out of, you know, having sex, leave out. You guys don't want anything serious with people at this time. I mean, that's for some of you guys. But if for other you guys, this person was in and out of your life playing mind games for some of you guys. Okay? If you know this guy, this person already. Um... Yeah, with the Knight of Wands, this is a great communicator. It's uh, Gemini, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Uh, they're great communicators, but, you know, it's just have sex, leave out. Have sex, come in, but nothing nothing steady. Nothing that was stable and secure, okay? But um, this person feels this energy, but let's see. I don't know, but this person is fixated on you. It's like, hmm... They have a lot of options, but you they want you. So do you. Yeah. Ten of Wands. Okay. Some of you guys may be feeling this burden right now on you. Um, dealing with too much in terms of family matters. Uh, for some of you kids, bills. Um, but, you know, it's like trying to release this burden. Trying to... Because Knight of Wands is also about fast-moving energy. 
okay but with the ten of wands something is bringing you down here i'm gonna find out what this is but it could be pretending some of you guys may have a dog out there a wolf dog to be exact but some of you guys feel older than what you are it's like life is just weighing you down um it could be over a death of someone close to you it could be a shelter it could be your money is not right it could be a job it could be a relationship it could be numerous things uh but you just want to move forward you want to move forward past this yeah ace of pentacles this is for some of you guys is about your business and your money okay yeah three of clubs in reverse you feel like you're not progressing when it comes to your business your finances you're not in a stable place at this time where you should be for some of you guys okay so this is having to do with your finances with the ace of pentacles all right you just feel like a low point um in terms of business business is not growing uh things are just not things are falling apart when it comes to your your money your money aspect okay it could be in terms of a family too but it's, you're just concerned about your money okay yeah the lovers Okay, wow. Uh, well, so with the lovers, the lovers, you have a choice in love. Again, some of you guys are single playing the field out there. If you're in a relationship, some of you guys are still doing your thing. <laughs> That's not my business, okay? But with the lovers, this person feels the connection. Okay, turn that down, please, Cliff. They feel the connection, all right? It's like a deep romantic connection here it was not only about sex with this person all right and this person may be going through their own um financial difficulties at this time they may be facing their own karma at this time okay where they need to release burdens as well all right but this was not only a sexual thing that's what i would say there's feelings involved here romantic feelings but at the same time you have you're going to have a decision to make in terms of love okay but a lot of uh self-reflection here okay with you in terms of what you want yeah three of cups okay now the three of cups came right side up okay so three of cups is about uh celebration reuniting um it, it doesn't have to be with somebody but you know um, celebrating your victories, reuniting with people like old friends or family that you haven't seen in a long time, okay? But this could also mean third-party situation or too many people just trying to get up in your business at this time, okay? Because you're remaining very, you're, you're silently manifesting what you want at this time. It has nothing to do with love. Although there is love on the board, it's more so having to do with releasing burdens and your money, okay? Your finances, all right, but three of cups definitely somebody wants to reunite with you there were definitely too many people uh in this connection but this person who's coming in is divinely guided is divinely sent you see with the clouds this person that's coming in is just for you all right but there were too many people in, like just uh, there's too many people around in this situation that's just um trying to get into business and trying to get in your business and you know if they know them trying to get in yeah there's just too many people around in this situation you might you guys may know a lot of people okay with the full card though i do see you moving forward i do see you moving to a new state you and your dog your children your family if you have a family but with the full card you're starting from zero okay leaving everything and starting fresh all right leaving behind a job leaving behind a home moving to a new state give yourself a fresh new start okay but there is definitely somebody that wants fresh new beginners with you they want to take a leap of faith towards you but at the same time they kind of iffy about it because um they don't know but at the same time they're gonna they're gonna do it okay they're they're, they're about action they're gonna do it okay yeah judgment oh god Judgment, Scorpio, Sagittarius, uh, definitely um, people are getting their karma. You may be going through your own karma right now with the Ten of Wands or your finances being affected. But with the judgment, a decision has to be made here. You need to make a decision on what you really want, okay? But for some of you guys, it's love, a decision of love because it fell on the lovers. But um, moving to a new place, okay? Um removing people out your life all right too many people in your business 
but these are people that's close to you as well okay so decisions decisions but making that decision all right and if you don't make the decision spirit is going to make it for you okay See the outcome, but really up in your head at this time, like you got your eye on the prize. Yeah, five of swords. There's a lot of fighting and argument, arguing going on around you at this time. Some of you guys may be in a toxic uh, environment um, that you're trying to get out of, but it's like a lot of uh, competition, people trying to compete with you, people trying to argue with you, just fight with you, but you're standing your ground at this time, okay? Yeah, but yeah, you see, oh, God, a lot of competition, a lot of competition, a lot of fighting, a lot of arguing, possibly about somebody else, doesn't necessarily have to be, this is a fucking burden on you, yes, it's a dynamic, it's a situation where, oh, God, King of Wands again. Yeah, you're about action. It's a dynamic where it's a people um, wanting to get into your business. People fighting over you. Some people are fighting over you, okay? Um, you're trying to release this burden. You're trying to take action and move forward in your life at this time. This could be over, like, somebody else. Yeah, King of Cups. Whoa. This may be a same-sex relationship, but King of Cups... Somebody is in love with you here with the King of Cups. Uh, secretly in love, though. They haven't said anything. But you're being very logical right now with the King of Wands. You're going through all the elements at this time. Because I have King of Wands, King of Cups, King of Swords. But King of Swords is Aquarius, Gemini, Libra. So you're re being very logical. You're being very wise. You're being very strategic at this time. You're trying to release this burden. You're trying to take action and move forward past this chaos. Five of Wands could also be... Um, mean mental conflict a power struggle within your own self but in terms of money trying to mm, trying to uh, fix your money situation at this time yeah king of pentacles in reverse you guys it's feeling like unstable this is your energy right side up is like stable secure but upside down is like it's like somebody feels like it's like arguments and fights over money like a power struggle over money and who's doing the most uh, when it comes to um, children or the bills or, you know, but you just don't feel in your element right now, which is the king of pentacles. You don't feel in your element, but somebody is arguing and fighting as well over what you're not doing. Okay. Over what you're not doing. You're not providing. You're not doing this. You're not doing that. But I see it's a burden on you because I see that you guys are like, all about action okay like really all about action some of you guys may feel and uh, may be in love with somebody else too okay secretly in love with somebody else too you want to take action but you got to release this burden first but it's uh, a lot of chaos around you at this time a lot of chaos a lot of jealousy a lot of envious people at this time four pentacles in reverse okay it's like you're releasing you're not holding on to old baggage anymore you're not holding on to this anymore. Yeah, justice. Some of you guys may be going to court. Some of you guys may be wait, waiting on a lawsuit. But a judgment is definitely coming. It's definitely going to be new beginnings on you. This may be something having to do with your family. Uh, it's like an arguing and fighting around some type of uh, lawsuit. But everything is going to work out in the end. I do see new beginnings uh, in the end. But with the justice, this sign of Libra, you're balancing out your own scales. I see, um, yeah, but, yeah, you're gonna, you're gonna win in the end. Yeah, Knight of Cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, definitely somebody wants to come in with their cup of love. Um, I don't know if you're ready for this, but they're taking their time, they're taking their time moving forward towards you. Yeah, Knight of Wands, this person was in and out of your life, Okay have sex leave out some of you guys may be doing this now but this person fell in love and if it's the lovers and the two of cups you may feel it too but ignoring the feelings that you have knight of pentacles wow you got a lot of knights coming out this person uh you have offers 
basically that you have a number of offers okay Taurus but it's up to you okay because five of wands me speaks a lot of people competition okay but Knight of Pentacles it's uh, your your energy but somebody wants to come in they're taking their sweet time but it may be a job it may be a person okay it may be something that you waited for because your eyes on the prize but when it comes in it's gonna be for long term it's gonna set you straight okay but this is somebody that wants something long term with you whether it's marriage uh, moving in together um, moving to another state together um, doing business together collaborating celebrating yeah something in those terms some of you guys may be dealing with a Queen of Cups Pisces Cancer Scorpio uh, at this time yeah but four cups up turn upside down this is a missed opportunity coming back around for you in love or just a missed opportunity in general yeah the devil uh sign of capricorn <laughs> but you guys are going through all the elements the emperor definitely an emperor is coming in but with the devil yeah um some of you guys are excessively drinking smoking sex addicts out there um trying to break free out of a toxic situation codependent situation trying to move forward but it's like this person is holding you back holding you back so there's the decision that you have to make will you make that decision i don't know but you guys are really in a toxic mindset toxic situation where the, you just want the fuck out okay but there's a missed opportunity coming coming back around for you the emperor this is possibly somebody older a business owner a boss okay but you guys are going through the elements right now but um somebody is definitely coming in okay this possibly is a good four c okay yeah but with the star wow emperor is um aries taurus the star is aquarius this person is like up there okay up there but this person is very hopeful uh about you and them it's too much cause just too much chaos around you at this time um yes but you're standing your ground with a star card you guys are healing oneself you see pouring out your cup of love your cup of trust and investing in yourself at this time it's like you see big things for yourself you see yourself as successful some of you guys are successful already out there business owners but really concerned about your finances but a lot of people have an eye for your finances and what you're doing in life and arguing and fighting and don't want you to move forward and just a lot of shit going on around you but you're determined to move forward you're very hopeful about your future okay but this person that's coming in may be a healer already some type of uh influencer all right this person yeah, Ten of Swords. You're trying to come out of this heartbreak. Leave everything behind. You're tired of feeling this pain. Definitely communication is coming in. And a Two of Cups is coming in as well. Somebody, you're going to be meeting someone. You're, gonna, you're weighing out your options, okay, at this time. You're really weighing out your options, what you really want to do, okay? Yeah, but you're doing it in secret, all right? But somebody secretly, somebody secretly, yeah, yeah but you have a lot of options too okay but this is a secret too okay but with the seven of pentacles you're really uh thinking about ways how to make money your money right now okay you're just focusing on your money and building but somebody wants to come in and build with you all right but this is a secret you're not going to see it coming but with the seven of cups you like to keep options too secretly <laughs> yeah wow wow look what i'm looking at the tower shit is gonna hit the fan yeah three of cups some type of reunion celebration for your efforts at work the tower shocking events coming to light nine of pentacles some of you guys are single uh want to be single or or are single but abundant the sun card uh really in the limelight yeah you guys are doing big things you guys are going to be doing big things okay the, the sun card some of you guys may be pregnant or have someone pregnant but i do see a lot of money around you i do see you taking care of yourself stable okay but there's a breakthrough coming for you guys there's a breakthrough that's going to come which is going to cause celebration but you're not going to see this coming okay because right now you're weighing out your options all right but you're going to have options in terms of love and business because i see a lot of business um business opportunities coming in but it may require you to travel but 
you need to leave you need to walk away from toxic environments if that's what you're doing you're ready to face the obstacles right now okay you're in pursuit of your happiness and i see it i see it a lot of people are going to be shocked uh with your turnaround okay right now you're uh, with a ton of wands energy but yo you guys you guys are fighters you guys are, are warriors okay all right but let's see who's this energy um coming in this uh divine coming in A lot of fighting, a lot of argument around you. And it could be due to somebody else. It could be due to somebody not wanting you to move forward because Three of Cups came out twice. This person doesn't want to see you happy. This person, yeah, this karmic drives me crazy. So definitely you guys are dealing with a karmic. It doesn't necessarily have to be marriage, but a long-term partner. So um, let me pull the karmic deck because that's what I saw. Uh-oh. Be careful with this person. Uh, be careful with things that you're eating, but you're you have a snake within your own house. I sold them a dream rooted in the seven deadly sins. Okay, so this person may be religious as well, but going to a spiritualist as well. God. Wanna leave you stuck. I gossip about you all the time. This person is trying to make you look bad. I long burn the evidence. I'm ha I'm going to get insight on you. Pregnancy scares trapped stalking you this person is fucking out of their mind but this relationship has done has been through their ups and downs but this person is about their money they want your money okay but you know i know my karmic days are numbered i resort to magic to get what i want i i watch your social media quite often this person is fucking berserk they're on top of you they're on top of you. If you're seeing other people, they're on top of them. It's causing a lot of fights and a lot of argument. But this person is resorting to magic. Okay, so please clean your energy at this time. This person does not want you to move forward. And they make it sure that they get what they, you know. And some of you guys, this is a marriage. Because look at the ring. This is a marriage. Okay. Wow. <laughs> but this person... Is making sure that to make you look bad. They're not saying what they're doing, but they're gonna make sure you look bad. They're gonna make you look bad, driving you crazy, stalking, stalking people, seeing who you're talking to, seeing where you're going, putting a GPS on your phone, all type of shit. You have no idea of the power you have over me. Wow, there's a lot of passion. This person is coming in a lot of passion. Okay, this person may have been in a connection themselves, okay? There's a lot I need to get off my chest. This person really wants to talk to you, really want to confess a few things to you. Yeah, I know you deserve better than this, okay? Yeah, this was like a back and forth thing for some of you guys, but I'm getting the clarity that I need. You're my best friend. You're the star of every naughty fantasy I have. I want to move in together. You're my sweet escape. So this person is also going through their own transformation. Okay, baby. They're going through their own transformation. But you see, I protect my heart. So this person never expressed to you how much they love you or how they felt about you. But this is a lot of built-up sexual passion that this person has for you. This person may be a business person, very good-looking, very distinguished, take care of themselves. Whoa. Wear shirts and ties, corporate. <laughs> okay. Go, Taurus. But, yeah. Um... Let me get a moon card here. Hello, I cannot do this right now. I am working, okay? Think you can give me a new one? Okay, yes. Didn't I buy you new cards already? Uh, the yes. The police officer is broken. Okay, well. Don't let pride get in your way. Full moon and Leo. Okay. So if you need help, ask for help. Some of you guys may have your Leo as a moon or rising moon or Venus in Leo. Uh, some of you guys may be dealing with a Leo, but I don't, um, but yeah, it's pride, but it is also confidence. So if you need help, ask for help, okay? Don't be afraid to ask for help, but yeah, but meditate and contemplate, okay? New moon and Pisces. Some of you guys may be dealing with a Pisces, but right now you're, uh, your practice is like the high priestess, okay? You're manifesting what you want, balancing our practicality and spirituality. Your emotions are running high right now. Yes. 
okay but it says your dreams need a practical plan and that's full moon and taurus so you may you guys may be a double taurus but whatever you're planning spirit is like your dreams need a practical plan so if one thing is not working out then there's another way but if you need help don't be afraid to ask people for help or you know you know extend like hey you know can you help me out in this don't let pride get in the way okay if you love someone just tell them if you need their help or somebody's help just tell them okay but don't be afraid to ask for help don't let pride get in your way okay yes you're confident but in terms of asking for what you want yeah resistance what we resist persists but this is the angel and the devil okay but it's also a power struggle within your own life and your and people okay people trying to control your life people trying to dictate your life your money is not going right but you want to go this way but then this person is pulling you that way and it's just leaving you fucked up and confused okay and upset at the same time but be open openness be embrace the possible i see a bright future ahead of you guys so spirit wants you to embrace the possible okay don't be afraid to walk into the unknown and ask for help all right self-worth love what you see and that's what you're doing you're really taking care of yourself with the king of wands um yes but at the same time um embrace open openness be open to embrace the possible that the help because right now resistance what we resist persists you're going through a power struggle it's like the devil and the angel but it could be people around you as well Okay, trying to control your life, trying to dictate your life, trying to tell you what you to do, trying to tell you to go this way, you want to go that way. It's a push and pull type of energy, okay? And it's causing a lot of fights, arguments, okay? Wholeness, all right? Become all that you are. Some of you guys may be young out there. Some of you guys may may just had a baby. But with wholeness, is like a rebirth. So you're going through your transformation process at this time. Starting all over again, looking through a fresh pair of eyes, Okay? Yeah, secrets. Let the cat out the bag. So somebody definitely wants to get in your business. But, you know, it's like people, hidden truths being revealed about people. Okay? Yes. Indulgence. But you see, this is you. I see you guys buying a pool. Some of you guys may love to swim, gaining weight. Some of you guys may try to be losing weight. But indulgence. Some of you guys may be overeating. But, yeah. But the good life, you're pampering yourself right now. But, uh, yeah. But secrets. Let the cat out the bag. What's the secret about? What's the secret about? Ooh. King of Swords and the Moon card. King of Swords is Aquarius, Gemini, Libra. The Moon card is Pisces, Taurus. This is a damn. This is a secret, secret, all right? The devil, whoa, toxic behaviors, toxic ways, four cups. So the secret is that you're not happy in a situation for some of you guys. You may not be happy at a job. You may not be happy with somebody within a connection. You may not be happy with family members. Yeah, you're not communicating effectively. Eight of Wands turn upside down. Yeah, mm. Queen of Cups, Nine of Swords, wow, yeah, this is somebody, possibly a child's mother, or you may be in a situation where you're, uh, you know, have a child with this person, you're not happy, Nine of Swords with the King, uh, with the Queen of Cups, you're really up your head, you have no more love to give in this connection, you don't feel the love there anymore, you feel like it's a toxic situation that you want to get out of, you find a lot, a lot about a lot of truth with this person, with the Four of Cups, you're not... Some of you guys are not in love with this person, with the King of Swords. Uh, you want this divorce. King of Swords speaks of divorce. You're very logical right now, very stoic. Uh, God, yeah, this is having to do with the Three of Swords, a third party situation. The Empress. There's another person involved here with the Empress. A wish fulfillment of yours. Emperor, Empress is the perfect match. Your perfect match. Yeah, King of Knight of Pentacles. You want this offer. You want something else from somebody. But you have to close out one cycle first. But you're not happy. Some of you guys are not happy in a connection. <sighs> Drinking too much. Smoking too much. Not sleeping right. Not, speak, not communicating effectively. 
Arguments, arguments, arguments. But the truth is, this person feels like there's no more love for them in a connection. And you don't have any more love for that person as well. You just want to move on with your life. That's it. For this concern, it's a uh, heartbreak, deceit, betrayal, somebody else, for some of you guys. It's just no more love there. And it could be, yeah, you get you get enlightenment. You guys are light workers out there, but celebration, you're definitely going to be celebrating at the end, possibly a divorce, a lawsuit that's coming through, a lot of money coming your way. Yeah, courtship, but definitely um, somebody's coming in that wants to spend quality time with you. Okay, you may be a different culture from this person, but I do see engagement, marriage, uh, promotion, okay? But it could be divorce as well. <laughs> okay, take it out, resonates. But it's three it's three glasses here, reunion, all right? But you're getting a lot of clarity about your situation and where you want to be. Uh, and who you want to be with. Yeah, but decisions, decisions. Yeah, you see, hidden truths are coming out about people, okay? So there was a lot of hidden truths that, you know, if you was in a long-term relationship or at a job, that's coming out about people that they were trying to hide themselves, but no more, okay? They want to find out about you and you'll find, yeah, stuck in the past. This may have been a third-party situation, but... Somebody's still stuck on you. You may be stuck in the past, but this person to keep bringing up the past, okay? It's like, get over it already. It happened. It's done. Yeah, wrong way. <laughs> okay, but you see, you're telling people, uh-uh, wrong way. Not in my, not, not my way. Go the other way, okay? So it's like, not in my business, not, but you're going in a new direction. You see what I'm saying? It's like, you guys are in a situation where you feel like, wow, I made the wrong decision here. It's the wrong way. I got to make a U-turn and go in the opposite direction. So you guys are choosing a new direction away from this toxic person, toxic environment, because uh, this person is not all that innocent themselves, okay? Doing black magic and all that shit. They're not that innocent themselves. Yeah, you see? Court paper file, going through your legal issues, but this is on the hush. All right? Nobody knows about this. Okay? But again, uh, it doesn't have to be divorce, but it could be, yeah, you see? So you're taking a time out for yourself. Pause. But I see somebody popping up on you, but uh, these circumstances are all going to be working out for you in the end. Celebration. Mm-hmm. Okay, yeah, you see, meeting two or more people, uh, discussions, plans, so collaborations, opening up a business, I think I see a lot of things flourishing around you, a lot of things blooming, but somebody has their eye on you, they're fascinated with you, this person may have blue, green eyes, hazel eyes, okay, some of you guys may have blue, green eyes, hazel eyes, but this person is absolutely fascinated with you. Who is this person's spirit? King of Wands, again, King of Wands is a fire energy, somebody that's going to take action. This person is uh, very good looking, very confident. Once they have their eyes set for you, that's it. But they're all about action. Okay, this person may have been a player, uh, was playing games with you in and out of your life, wasn't really give you a, a direct answer how they feel about you, but this person can't get their eye off of you. They're secretly watching you. Yeah, this is possibly was a third party situation that this person put you in or you put this person in. Take it out, resonates. But it was just too many people involved involved in this situation. This person is heartbroken over you. Okay? Yes, they are. Yeah, Page of Pentacles. This person may be younger than you, but they want to come in and start fresh with you. Something like, like hey, let's go out. You want to get to know each other. You know, you want to start over. Yeah, they wanna they want it to grow into something more. Okay? Yeah, two of swords. But right now you're just blocked out. Hey, <laughs> you're blocked out. The chariot, you moving forward, but this person is coming in. Okay. <laughs> All right. Yeah. 
Yeah, the tower. But this is going to be shocking because this person is coming in to claim they want this with you. They want this with you. It's going to be very shocking. Some of you guys may have been heartbroken over this person as well. Knight of Cups. This person is in love. They want to come in with their cup of love. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Wow. I'm seeing a lot here. Yeah. Okay. But, yeah, this person is in love with you. They want to come in. But it's going to have to be a discussion. This person, is uh, again, is possibly a boss type. You guys are possibly a boss type. But I don't see you jumping for joy or just be like, oh, yeah, yeah, hey, yeah, why not? No, I don't see that happening. Okay? Where's my other? Oh. Okay, unbound, okay, unbound. Wow, so a lot of people are getting their karma, but a lot of people want you stuck. You see, there's a lot of competition. Three again, okay, too many people. Releasing soul patterns, contracts, and past lives. Wow, so you're releasing people at this time. You're uh, you're breaking soul ties, okay, sexual, yeah, that's why it's blocked, okay. Um, relationships, yeah, you're, uh, you're releasing yourself, you're ascending, you're elevating at this time. But soul patterns, contrast, you're releasing it. You're releasing it. You're not bounded to anyone. Okay? Wow. You pull from here. Shadow. Okay. Dark side to unhealthy ego. Okay, so you guys are dealing with your shadow side right now. Okay, um, really going through your transformation, possibly partying too much, drinking too much. Um, yeah. Uh, greed, selfish, rage, envy. Whoa. Okay, so you're really dealing with your devil energy at this time, your shadow side. Okay, so you really need to stay prayed up because with the shadow side, I do see you guys just sex addicts, just running in and out of people. Take it, I resonates. But yeah, but I do see moving, okay, purchasing a house, moving, moving, relocating, okay, yes, whoa, so many cards here, bear with me, these cards are kind of um, big, so just bear with me for a minute, okay. Breaking generational curses, okay? But still dealing, again, still dealing with your shadow side, all right? Some of you guys may love to wear uh, sunglasses, go clubbing, but you really need to work on that shadow side. Drinking too much, having sex, indulgent, yes, drugs, okay? But some of you guys may have been the black sheep of the family, but you guys are the strong ones, strong-hearted uh, empaths out there, spiritual healers, so... Yeah, but I do see you guys moving to another job, move to a new state, getting away from chaos, getting away from toxic, toxic behaviors. But please uh, be mindful of your surroundings at this time because you guys are just living it up, okay? Not giving a fuck. But when you when it says breaking generational curses, it's like you're going to be the first one to break the rules, what they say, okay? So if you guys are traditional or you know conventional you're unconventional okay you're gonna break it you're gonna break you know the religious patterns or um, being broke yeah you're gonna break it okay orphan yeah oh five huge changes are on the way though but with orphan you feeling lonely some of you guys may have been adopted out there orphan but feeling abandoned in life feeling like nobody cares about you feeling like in a dark space this shadow space yeah, but all that glitters. So what they say, all that glitters ain't gold, right? So be mindful of what you're getting yourself into at this time. So you guys may be born um, May 5th, May 16th, okay? But yeah, all that glitters is gold, ain't gold. But you see a lot of masks, okay, with people. So again, be careful with your surroundings and be careful with people trying to sell you a dream at the same time. But a lot of people are after your money. Okay, I tell you that much. And they have masks on, even in your own relationship. But a lot of people want to get in your business too because it's like they see you doing big things. Okay? Is 
Is it this deck? Yeah. Yeah, but you're going to be breaking those generational curses. Wow, that's huge. Went full of money. Bam, that's all I'm going to take. So, again, all that glitters. Be careful with your money and be careful with overspending, overindulging. Okay? Because, yeah, as soon as it comes, it's going to leave as well. You're about to receive a windfall of money or pay raise. Money is currently in a positive cycle. This is a great time to treat yourself or make that big purchase. See? So, moving. You're making that big purchase. You're breaking the generational curses, but at the same time, be careful. Okay? Be careful. I see it too. And that money. Growth. Yeah, definitely money again. But laws of attraction. The more you give, the more you get. Expect good news and money matters. A raise or a new job offer. Money will soon start flowing to your business. Promising opportunities awaiting. Okay, I'm going to just stop pulling from there. Let me get my um, working cards. Because a lot of money is heading your way. A lot of money is heading your way. Okay? This is what you're manifesting. Okay? But, again, you're going to surprise a lot of people. That's what I said, right? People are not going to expect this from you. They don't know what you're manifesting. Master. Master. Okay? So, you're mastering, you're mastering your feelings right now, how you control your feelings. But you're staying on people's level at this time. You're mastering your skills at this time. Okay? But master how you handle your thoughts and emotions on a daily basis as a successful entrepreneur journal. Write down your ideas. Some of you guys are journalists out there, rappers, writers, okay? Um, but write, writing, authors. Keep a journal of your business journey. Write down all of your dreams, desires, and goals. Paint a picture of the lifestyle you want and review it daily, okay? And what do I have? Selling. And I do see you guys selling products. It doesn't have necessarily have to be clothes, but it could be uh, food. It could be... Um, uh, skincare products, okay, but selling, okay? Learn the arts of sales. Embrace selling as a sacred exchange of energy, well-being, and goodwill between you and your ideal clients. Okay, let me see this card now. Crystal ball, okay? Some of you guys may be tower readers out there getting tower, uh, tower readings, okay? Yes, but crystal ball, events taking place in the future, inner knowing, occult and estratic, esoteric, I'm sorry, occult and esoteric knowledge, stepping into your spiritual power, esoteric knowledge, okay? So, yeah. Well, occult things, but somebody's definitely uh doing occult things on you. Mountain, you got you see, you guys are facing the obstacles right now, but your come up is about to be like bad out. Obstacles and challenges, possible delays, patience needed, required per perseverance. But yeah, you're 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 doing it. You're doing it. You see, you're doing it. You're walking away. You're doing it. It's gonna be shocking to everyone. Okay, poor health. Take care, especially your mental mental health, okay? Take care of yourself, please, Taurus. Neglecting health. Health needs assessments, mental health conditions, addictive habits. The devil and the shadow side, okay? So, mm, careful with those celebrating, baby, okay? No, I didn't say your name. Let me get some of these, and I'm going to close out your reading soon mirror okay mirror in order to change my life outside i need to change inside exactly once i am open to this change my exterior reality will begin to mirror those new shifts okay that's right oh wait i didn't pick from here wow just one card spirit from this deck please Coins. Wow, a lot of money heading your way. Lots of money. Taurus, money coming in, wealth, good investment, career, sales, finance, getting a raise, lucky. A lot of blessings. Mm. Okay. 
<laughs> whoa, whoa, they're not gonna see this, Taurus. Okay, they're not gonna see this from you. Assert yourself. So you need to be uh, more assertive, okay? Go for what you want. The time is right for soulmate connections. Birth of a child is also likely. So again, somebody may be pregnant here or maybe getting pregnant or you maybe got, maybe somebody's pregnant. But challenges, okay? Take time out from problems or conflicts or approach softly to avoid making matters worse, okay? Yes. But, Taurus. The way you're about to flip this script, people are not going to see this, okay? People are definitely going to, you're going to surprise a lot of people, okay? But anyway, Taurus, I have to go. I love you guys. I'm possible. You're possible. Your girl, Tosh, I'm out.